In this video, we'll balance the equation KBRO3 decomposing into KBR plus O2. That's potassium bromate breaking down into potassium bromide plus oxygen gas. Let's count the atoms up on each side of the equation. We have one potassium, one bromine, three oxygens, and on the product side of the equation, one potassium, one bromine, and two oxygens. When I have an odd number of oxygens here, I like to get this side to an even number because then I can change the O2 and it should work out. So to do that, I'll multiply KBRO3 by two. And this two, it applies to everything here. So I have one potassium times two. It gives me two potassiums, one bromine times the two. That gives me two bromines. And then the oxygens, three times two. That'll give me six oxygens. That's good because now to fix the oxygens, I just need to figure out two times something gives me six. Two times three, that gives me six. So I'll put a coefficient of three right here. Two times three, I have six oxygens on both sides. To fix the potassium and bromine, I need two of each and just put a coefficient of two in front of the KBR. One times two, that equals two. And then the BR, one times the two, that equals two. And we're done. This equation is balanced. The trick here really is to get this odd numbered oxygen to an even number, so then you can go ahead and get these balanced. This is Dr. B with the balanced equation for potassium bromate decomposing into potassium bromide and oxygen. Thanks for watching.